One of the great things about a company like Beam and even the spirits industry is that we have provenance and heritage and real people associated with our brands. If you want to talk to Jim Beam's great grandson, you can do that. It's right here, it's in our space. He works at our company. If you want to talk to Bill Samuels Jr. or Rob Samuels, the grandson and the son of the guy who founded Maker's Mark, Gary Nelthrop, whose father started Cruise and Rum. They're here, they're in our company, they work here. And it's amazing when we take these folks out or when our, our brand fans or our loyal fans meet these people, it's like they're seeing rock stars and it's really fun and it's a great uh, marketing asset to have, to work with, and to be out there and tell these great brand stories. Beam is the place to be for the last couple of years. I mean, we've been called one of the most innovative spirits companies in the business right now. I mean, we've launched new products this year that accounted for close to 30% of the growth that our company has seen. So it's been really exciting to be kind of at the forefront of that. And those ideas come from all over the place. And we work with our R&D labs and our scientists who build these things on our distillers out in the distilleries to really come up with great insights around consumer products, what they're looking for, and then figure out how our products fit into the consumer's lives to actually do that. The global aspect of this company can't be discounted at all. You realize very quickly that we have very big businesses in places like Australia and Germany and Spain and India. We're growing extremely fast and Russia. So we're a global organization and we look at a marketing level, we look at our big power brands. We try to have consistent campaigns, consistent ways of talking about our brand to consumers all over the world. And what's exciting is that you have the opportunity to interact with these. And whether you work in global marketing or operations or any part of our business, um, you have the opportunity to interact with people from all over the world um, trying to grow our spirits brands. We've been really focused on growing in the digital and social space because that's where our consumers are. Um, and when you look at how we're attacking that with our brands, we have brands that people naturally want to talk about. And we create experiences that people naturally want to talk about that. Technology has really enabled that conversation to happen faster today than it ever has before. And we love that because the great things that we do for people, whether they're tasting our product or whether they visit our distillery or whether they've experienced us at a concert or a sporting event, they can tell people about it very, very quickly with our brand at the center. If you look at the brand portfolio we have, if you look at the categories that we're participating in, we are there at the forefront of what's happening in the marketplace. And it's really exciting to have big, iconic brands that people know and people love and are passionate about.